Hello world, my name is Ben and this is AnyLogic 101, a video series where I explore and share quick tips I learned over the years. Today I want to show you how you can use superscripts and subscripts in text. So, you know, it's very easy to display text in AnyLogic. It's very easy to display values. So in my model I have a little variable with a number and in my text object I'm saying please just display whatever number that variable has. So this is what we see here. But wouldn't it be nice to actually format this a little bit nicer? You can see it's already auto formatted with a little comma here. But what about subscripts, superscripts or other special signs? Well it turns out you can actually um, use Unicode to do that. And Unicode basically gives you the power to use any kind of sign that you want. So let's say, let's change that text when I click this button. So I'm saying for the text, please change the text to uh, the variable number. And then I want to add a subscript. And you do that by calling Unicode uh, code. I'm not sure what the what the word for that is, but for example, for a superscript, the code is a backslash, which I'm trying to find on my keyboard. Where is it? There we are. Uh, and then it's U00B2. That's for my notes. So when we run this, so actually what I needed to do is, it wasn't working previously, I needed to um, concatenate my strings properly. So previously I've said just set the text of that text object to variable plus my Unicode character. But this plus is, is confusing to Java because variable is, is a double number. So what we need to do is to say first convert the variable number, the double to a string and then concatenate it with that little superscript. Now, if we run the model now, what we get is the value and then concatenated my little superscript. Now, you can just Google Unicode and you'll see all sorts of other different useful characters that you can just concatenate to your strings in a similar fashion. Just make sure you're actually concatenating, not adding numbers. I hope that's helpful. Thanks a lot. Thank you.